Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you do not have permission to save in this location error. So you're having a file permission error. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So the first thing you want to do is navigate over to the folder location you're having this problem with. So let's say we want to go into our local drive here. And let's say my issue is with a specific folder on my account. So let's say my favorites folder, for example, in the favorites bar. So let's say the favorites bar is the folder I'm having the problem with. I'm going to right click on it and I'm going to select properties. I'm going to select the security tab. And then I'm going to select where it says for special permissions or advanced settings, click advanced. Go ahead and select advanced. And now at this point where it says owner, click the change button. So go ahead and left click on that. Select where it says advanced down here. And then select find now. Go ahead and select your computer account name from this list. So my name is computer user. That's my account name. And I'm going to select OK. Select OK again. And now you're going to check mark where it says replace owner on subcontainers and objects. So go ahead and select apply. Select OK. And then OK again. And now it's where it says to change permissions, click edit. Go ahead and select edit. And you want to select it to full control. For your account, so computer user, make sure it's all set to allow, or whatever account you were having the problem with, make sure they are all set to allow here. And select apply and OK. If you're still having a problem, you can go back into advance and just select where it says owner, change it to everyone. So you just type in everyone here. Select check names and then select OK. And then you would be able to go ahead and replace owner and then select apply and OK. Again, that's a, all the users on your computer, so that's what that means, and it shouldn't really be a problem, honestly. I have never seen a problem with that, um, personally. But anyway, pretty straightforward. Again, especially on localized files, you only have like a couple of folders here. So pretty straightforward. Select OK, and then hopefully you should be able to save to that folder again, and you shouldn't have any more problems. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. do hope that I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.